Justin Pugh's return this season just got a whole lot clearer. The Giants' offensive lineman underwent an MRI on his back on Wednesday after being unable to finish the last period of practice. Pugh, who has missed the last three games, believes he may have returned to the practice field a little too quickly. I don't want to put the other lineman in a bad spot, he said. I backed off a little bit and we'll see how it goes. Pew believes he is day-to-day -day but still needs to speak with the doctors regarding a decision to shut him down for the rest of the season. Just making sure I'm healthy and that's kind of where we're going, he said. Don't want to make it even worse. It's not at the point now where I am going to need surgery but we don't want to get it to that point. Dustin Bradford GT Images Mary T.I.S.C.H.M.A.S. Giants co-owner Steve Tisch was spotted observing practice on Thursday. Tish, who does not usually spend much time at the team facility, appeared cheery as he made his way around the building and was having lunch with fellow co-owner John Mara. Tish did not speak to the media while walking by at the start of practice. Schedule change earlier this season when two anonymous Giants complained about Ben McAdoo, one of the complaints was that he was working the team into the ground the day before games. It seems that will no longer be the case under Steve Spagnala. El Sagetti Images The interim head coach is making an adjustment to the team's weekend practice routine. Under McAdoo, Friday would be treated as a walkthrough and the team would instead have a launch day on Saturday where they would go 80%. Spagnola said Friday will be a short practice focusing on the red zone while having a walkthrough on Saturday. Shepback WR Sterling Shepard Hamstring was back at practice on Thursday after missing Wednesday's session. He was limited and did no contact, though Spagnol said the WR was trending in a positive direction. Rob Kerjitty Images RB Orleans Darkwa was a new addition to miss practice, but it was because of an illness and not injury-related. The Jason Pierre Paul Finger and CB Eli Apple hip back did not practice for the second straight day, but Spagnol said Apple was day-to-day -day while he was hopeful Pierre Paul could get some work in on Friday. R.B. Wayne Gallman hip, pound B.J. Goodson ankle, D.T. Damon Harrison elbow and R.T. Chad Wheeler concussion were all limited.